Hi, this tutorial is a basic introduction to storyboards in Xcode. Now with the release of Xcode 4.2 and iOS 5, we have a new feature available in Xcode called storyboards. And storyboards are a way of visually laying out the application with multiple views. And you can see an example here of a storyboard that has several different scenes. Now in the past, we've used individual nib files for your interface layout. So for example, this is a project that used a nib file for the interface layout. And when we use that, we only had one screen or one view at a time that we could see and edit. And to change it or to work with a different screen, we would have to open up a completely separate nib file. So the difference between this and seeing individual interface screens compared to working with a storyboard, with a storyboard we can have all of our screens or views available in one location. And not only that, but we can also see the relationship of one screen to another. We can see how they're connected. So for example, here we can see our main view controller, our main screen is connected to three other screens. But in order to get to this one with the pose, the navigation would have to go from the main to this view controller before they can get to this one. So it shows you the relationship of how the navigation will work as well. We can also see from these little icons here the types of transitions. And the terminology that's used in storyboards is that these view controllers are actually called scene. So a scene is an individual screen in your application, which is a view controller. And the transition between your view controllers is called a segue. And these icons in here represent the type of segue or the transition that will occur between these different views. And if I zoom in a little bit here and I select one of these segues and then I open up my utility panel, right, I can see in the utility panel uh, the style and the transition type for this segue. So we can have modal, we can also have push. Modal means it's going to pop on top. And then we have the transition type, so how you want it to handle navigating from our main view controller into our settings view controller. So you can see that this is set for modal, and so this is the icon for modal. And this is a different icon type here, and when I select it, you can see that this is set for a push style. So our storyboards are basically combining scenes and segues, and our scenes were what you might have previously worked with as nib files. So these individual scenes in other versions of Xcode, or if you set up a new project to use nib files, these would represent each an individual nib file. So that's a brief overview of storyboarding and I'll have some additional videos to show you how to create projects using storyboards and how to navigate around from scene to scene using segues and how to attach a segue and create navigational structures in your applications.